my name is Ashley. Today I'm going to show you how to steam your beets. What it is is the beets they have a lot of nutrients, a lot of vitamin. We don't want to put that in the water and kill it by cooking it. We want to keep all the nutrients, the juice, the sweetness into the beets. So those are from my garden and those are the leaves from the beets that I picked them up. Later on, maybe I'm going to show you another dish. Do not throw them away because it has a lot of vitamin in it. So what we have to do is we have to put the water in, into the pot. And you put maybe as much as to your steamer height. Let's see. See over here, you can see the water, it's not sticking to the steamer. It's barely, barely. So you just keep it like this way. You'll put your beads in it. And meantime, let's put the fire on, okay? So uh, after you put the beads, it can be on top or whatever, as long as you can cover it. Now, we put the fire on. It's going to boil beginning. Once it boils, you just turn off your fire very, very low, just like this, very low. And it has to steam. It will take you maybe about 45 to one hour. But between them, you can come and check it how. Take a skewer or a knife or a fork and push it in and see if it's soft. If it's soft, it means it's done. If it's not, Leave a little bit more and your beets will be done. But I'm going to show you after it's done, we're gonna, I'm going to show you how good it will do. But before that, I was going to say your beets, make sure that you have a brush and brush it. A day, be, um, a night before, put that in the water so because it has a lot of mud. doesn't matter how much you wash, still will be some sand. So take your brush and brush it very well. Keep that into the water. Next day, do it again very well and then you put in your steamer. Okay, now the beet is done. It's already, it took me about 50, 50, 55. And now I'm gonna take them out. I let it rest just for a few minutes so it will cool off, like five, 10 minutes. And I wanna show you that how easy it will peel. It's much better than buying with the can. This is nice and fresh. Then, yeah, then you'll cut it about like the way you want it. Four pieces, five pieces. There you go. And this is how you put in your plate. Let's peel them off. You can cut a little smaller, a little bigger, or different directions, different uh, shape, whatever you want. Just cut like this. Let's do like this way. And then we do like this. You can do anything you want. We will clean it. It's already like really smells very delicious. These beets are very, very, very healthy for you. There we go. This is how you present your guest. Let's do one more. By just peeling like this. Your hands get red, but don't worry about it. It will clean up very easy. This is very delicious dish, I will say. All right, there you go. This is how you put at your table. And then, if you want, you can put a little bit yellow pepper. Look how beautiful it's gonna look, and it's gonna open your friend's family's appetite. This is the red bell pepper. You can even put around the dish if you want. If you like onion, you put on top if you don't like it. You don't have to. Anything I put over here, it's optional. Whatever you like, you can add for your, for your dish. And a little parsley. There we go. Now we will take a little bit oil. You can take the oil and you can put like this, like so. And the lemon. You can put as much as you want. Just like delicious 
salad or d'oeuvres with other dishes you can put at the table and there you go in case if you want to add onion you can do that if no this is the way i prepare and my kids my family they enjoy it it's such a beautiful dish the look it has to tell you come and eat me that's how delicious it is it smells good it tastes good now we have to put the seasoning usually over here i mix it cilantro and mint which we do love it so you just put this on top very little okay and a little pepper and there you go this is the way we enjoy it well i hope you'll make this dish and you will enjoy it try it and if you like it don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you very much bye bye